Christine de Bruyne, Happy New Year. A gold medal on the very first morning of 2022. There can't be many better ways to wake up from New Year's Eve. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. <laughs> I haven't really been sleeping a whole lot because of all the COVID tests and we've had done five PCR tests this week. Um, and every single time we have to wait until the morning to know the result. So there hasn't been much sleeping going on. So it's, it's pretty sweet that we started the year like this. So tell us about today's race. I mean, this is a, a tough track to drive a sled down anyway. Really quick transitions. Does that make it much harder for the monobob drivers? Yeah, I think it does because the monobob's a lot more skiddy. Um, so it's really hard to figure out the, the exact amount of steer to do. Because if you do too much, then your back end's just going like crazy. So yeah, I think it's a lot more difficult than two men. And of course, six training runs, and you also had to drive the two-seat sled. So how do you split that? Well, because of all the, the COVID tests going on in our country, um, we actually weren't able to do full six runs. We were only allowed to take four. So two every day after everybody else was gone. Um, to be quite honest, I thought there's no chance of getting out of this. So I did one monobob run just to qualify and I called it a day because I was like, it's probably not going to happen. Um, but then it did. So yeah, I did one monobob run. And how about prospects for the women's race on Sunday? What's, what's kind of nice about this track is that not that many people have that much experience on it. So it ends up being a very level playing field. So I wouldn't count anybody out at this point.